Uh, mini Tour of Ireland continues then as we move on to Nice. Now then for this two mod two furlong race and it's a four year old plus chase, grade three. Amazing Sablazo, D. Hinton, Apostle, Ben Benici, Bocare, Arnold, C. Clark, Charles Dickens, S. Gray, Eskimo, Dave, J. Shea, In a Flash, G. Clutterbuck, Joseph Stalin, Paul Rhodes, King of New Mexico, Matty McLean, Quintana, M. Cairns, Sonic Boom, Kev Con, Uncle Ernie, John's Jumpers, Glorious Slap, Joshua Sutherland, Highlighter Quartz, Charlie and Orintz, D. Thompson. All being called in then, and away they go, and it's In a Flash. Just the first to show at the moment, but we'll wait to see what happens when they get themselves settled down. There's a couple of others there that are fighting for the lead, and the one on the rail, Charles Dickens, looks like it's going to show the lead, and he went straight through the top of that one, didn't he? Uh, nearly jettisoned the pilot over the top of his head, but um, the jockey did want to stick in there, and they come to the second, and let's see how he jumps this one much better that time. So Charles Dickens then in the lead, with Sonic Boom in second, Quintana is in third, and then comes Eskimo Dave and Uncle Ernie, and then Joseph Stalin, and then a flasher after that one. But there you go. Quite a good pace at this moment, and Charles Dickens is in the lead with Eskimo Dave back in second. Good four or five lengths back in second. Then comes Quintana and in a flash. The main group are pretty tightly packed. You can see Apostle is just the back marker, and Gloria Slap is the one in the red and black closest to us. But Charles Dickens it is. He's got the inside and leads. And he's a good four lengths clear of Quintana in the white colours. And Eskimo David the green on the inside. And one's gone there. King of New Mexico has crashed out of the race. That's a four at that one. So we've lost one then. And Charles Dickens leads with Quintana second as they come up past the stand here. Nice. And that's the winning post. And Charles Dickens it is that leads from Quintana in second. And then comes in a flash and Eskimo Dave and then Joseph Stalin and Bocare are on an amazing Sablazo and then Sonic Boom and Gloria Slap and Uncle Ernie and then Highlighter Quartz Apostle and finally a rinse racing out into the country then towards the next fence they've got 10 furlongs still to race and Charles Dickens takes them along in front from Quintana getting much closer in second as they jump this sixth fence and a sticky jump again by the leader has allowed Quintana to move right up onto his tail now then and the lead is just a length as they take the next better jump this time by Charles Dickens and he extends the lead back up to two again from Quintana in second and then in a flash is third Uncle Ernie is four and Joseph Stalin's five and Eskimo Dave and Bocare Arnold after that one we've got Sonic Boomer's amazing Sablazo and highlights of quartz at this next one and over that one there's a better jump by Quintana and Quintana's now right back up on the uh, outside of Charles Dickens Behind them, Joseph Stalin and Uncle Ernie are going well, and then in a flash, Eskimo Dave is still going well, and we look to the back, we can now see Apostle is just the back marker. But they're all in shot, and with just six furlongs to race, you wouldn't really want to rule out anything at the moment, apart from the faller king of new mexico so charles dickens is in front still from quintana in second uncle ernie appears to be going really well in third as they jump that next one that was fence number nine they've got four more to jump Charles Dickens in the lead, Quintana, Uncle Ernie, and then in a flash over that one, they go, oh, a mistake there by Uncle Ernie, just when he was looking as though he was going best of the four, and that's not the stuffing right out of him, and he's dropped right back now as they jump the third last, and this time it's Charles Dickens who gets it, gets it best, in a flash is second, Bocare Arnold is making some good ground around the outside as they swing into the home straight with two fences to go, three furlongs to run, Charles Dickens in the lead, Bocare Arnold in a flash, Sonic Boom, Uncle Ernie trying to to get back in it. Amazing Sablazo on the outside. Sonic Boom and Joseph Star and Eskimo Dave. None of them are out of it yet but it's Bocare Arnold and in a flash as they come to the second last. Over that one they go and it's Bocare Arnold and in a flash. Bocare Arnold's a length up now from in a flash at the final fence. Bocare Arnold jumps it well. They're all queuing up to challenge him. Uncle Ernie is the big challenger on the outside. They've still got a furlong to go and it's Uncle Ernie. Joseph Starlin, Sonic Boom and Eskimo Dave but it's Joseph Starlin on the outside for Sonic Boom. Eskimo Dave and Uncle Ernie racing up towards the line. It's Joseph Stalin's got enough in his tank to win this. I think Joseph Stalin wins it from Eskimo Dave in second and Sonic Boom is third. Uncle Ernie was fourth and Charles Dickens was next. Well, that was a race and a half, wasn't it? Joseph Stalin wins it for Paul Rhodes. Eskimo.